Hi, hello. My name is Loey. It has been a while since we did a proper try-on haul here on my channel. So this dress is super cute. It has a collar and it is a bit structured, but it's also just a very comfortable, stretchy, fitted dress that fits me like a freaking glove. I I love the color, especially with my red hair. I never really used to wear like navy or a lot of blues in general, I feel like. But now that I've gone to the auburn side, I definitely feel like I love the way that it makes my hair pop. And this dress is just super comfy and I don't know, I think it's pretty casual, but you can also, you know, dress it up with various accessories. Some of this, like this outfit, was gifted to me by Dolls Kill. But a lot of it I also bought myself. I'd say it's pretty half and half. Off the top for this little outfit is this little blue baby doll cami and it just says who cares on it with a little bow. I thought it was really really cute and it's just a very simple cotton tank top. Um, I love that blue color again. It looks good with my hair. And then I just have this little plaid skirt. And I really like this a lot. Um, it does kind of look a bit shiny and costumey when you look at it up close, but I found that once I wore it out, it didn't really translate that way. Um, at least I hope it didn't. It is really, really cute. I kind of wish it was more of a matte material because for some reason this just reads a bit... Uh, like I said, like it's like a costume, like I'm, you know, dressing up as Cher from Clueless, which I was last year. But, but I did really like the outfit overall, and I thought that it fit super well, which so many of Dolls Co. items do. To me, Dolls Kill was running like a Labor Day sale, and so everything was 20% off um, on top of already marked down prices for some things. Normally, their plus pieces go like that. So I was really excited to get my hands on this fit, and I wound up wearing it in a TikTok video that I did. But it is this really cute like sheer mesh shirt. It just has like rainbows and clouds and patterns all over it And it's this really really cute pastel-y purple color and then I got it actually with this little skirt So the skirt is this like gorgeous sky blue color And it just buttons here at the side as well as zips up it has a white trim at the bottom and actually underneath it has a little slip so you don't have to worry about the skirt like flying up or anything because the slip itself is actually, it's not like a stretchy material, it's just like very um, stiff fabric. So it just stays right in place pretty much no matter what if it's right to the body and then the skirt over top is like this loosey goosey skater pleated skirt. I, I really love this top. It's from the Delia's line at Dolls Kill. It's like standard t-shirt material with a cute little dragon friend on it. And then it has sheer black mesh sleeves down the side. It's like a little bit shorter. It's more of like a cropped style. I don't even know what you call these really. Is it just like a skater skirt? It's like that schoolgirl, like pleated and has the trim right here design. Um, but I paired it with this skirt and this skirt fits so perfectly. I don't feel like it's like super, super short. Um, and I definitely feel like confident wearing it out right now. I love everything in this video. Oh, but one of my favorite pieces is this like sheer stretchy blouse. I don't have a lot of blouses in my closet. I think just mostly because back in my retail days and back when I like worked office jobs and stuff but I just felt like it was a more trendy way to do a blouse and I love the really pretty baby pink color and I loved that top so much but I also grabbed it in this blue color and for both of them I wound up just wearing a like white bodysuit underneath you definitely have to wear something whether it's a bra you want to show off or a tank top or a bodysuit but they're really nice basics to have and I think will pair with so many different things in my closet I know with the same
same feel is this cardigan. It has like a fuzzy top, which is so, so, so cute. And then the rest of it is just the soft wool material and then it buttons obviously like cardigans often do. I thought this was so cute and such a fun way to kind of warm up those styles, you know. Paired all of that with this argyle skirt. It's this pink and purple diamond pattern and I'm obsessed with I like this skirt. I have a lot of like skater skirts and like flared styles in this haul just because a lot of that is what Dolls Kill has. But I like that this one was a more fitted skirt while still being super stretchy and super, super, super soft and comfortable. I wish you guys could like reach through the screen and feel this because it feels insanely soft. It's so comfy. I got this really sick dress. It's a sheer all over dress, so you need like a slip or something to wear underneath. For my try on purposes, I wore that bodysuit from earlier. However, you could also wear a slip underneath. I have an all nude slip. Uh, I kind of think I might wind up getting like a black one instead for this dress because I think it would be more striking. It just has long sleeves and little thumb holes. How cute is that? And it has all of these images of like pretty girls who look slightly distorted and like binary code. Is this an ARG on a dress? Who knows? All I do know is I really, really like it and I'm excited to wear it out. I also have a solid top in that same print. I didn't wind up doing a try on of this. Uh, I don't know why, I've already worn it once for one of my Blair Witch gameplay videos, but it has like a mock neck and it's just a standard little top, but same print as that. Dress. I love this skater skirt in like this astrology print. It feels sort of Harry Potter to me. I don't know why, but it just has all of these like astrology symbols and stuff all over. They have a matching top for this that the model was wearing. It's like a sheer top and the model was wearing it with just like a black bra. And I really wish I had gotten the whole look now in hindsight. I just wore it with a black tank top and it is cool, but I think the overall look, like everything together, was so much cooler. So I may go back and go get that. Somewhat similar feel is this really cute little slip dress. It's just covered in suns and moons and stars. And I think that the model was originally pairing this over like a white t-shirt. So I wound up pairing it over just a white like turtleneck. And I loved the overall look so fall. And especially with that little plaid bag from earlier, I think it would be such a fun autumn-y like spooky season fit. I really like the dress so much. It's super, super, super stretchy and just fits really well. Well, let's talk about a little outfit that has been circulating my social media, um, just has been a little bit everywhere lately. And I will admit, this fit snapped. I have the full stylized outfit coming up in an Outfits of the Day video. It is my ultimate I'm Baby fit. And it but I paired it with this skirt, and the skirt is insane. It has clouds and little angel babies and like roses and all of this stuff all over it on this sky blue background. And oh my god, I love this freaking outfit. The skirt is insanely high quality. Actually, originally, I think the skirt was like 64 bucks but I wound up getting it on sale for like 30 something and then I just checked recently and it's already marked down to like $24, so. Such a bargain for a piece that I'm so obsessed with. I wound up buying it again. That is how obsessed I am. outfit but in a different colorway. So instead of a blue top, it is a purple top, literally exact same top, exact same proportions, uh, just same thing, purple. And then the same skirt but in this pink print with like clouds all over it. Super simple but I think looks totally, totally different and unique. After how obsessed I was with the first version, I couldn't like not get it again in different colorways. Love both of those looks. I love that like pastel, like little angel baby feel. And I'm baby. I decided to 
drown out all of the violent fear I was feeling after learning this by buying myself a Leo tank top. Um, it's just black, like Leo and flames on it. But I love how that paired with this skirt. And it's like this leopard printed pleated skirt. Looks very feline altogether. Very powerful oh so leo i'm thriving in my newfound uh fire placement in my astrology chart uh who knew and for my final outfit and the final items in this haul i have this little set uh i did pair these together for this outfit although they came separately i like the look together a lot it is a little purple halter top, and I haven't seen a halter top like this in years, but it's so fun. It has that purple argyle diamond print on it. Again, looks like something straight out of the click books. I'm absolutely freaking obsessed. And it is like a very fitted material, which is perfect because it flows almost like seamlessly into the skirt of this outfit, which is the same print, but in like a pencil skirt design. It's super, super comfy which is nice and again I do feel like I have a lot of pleated skirts in this haul uh, which I certainly don't mind but it is nice to get some variety in here yeah. now this might be embarrassing or show how little I want to try with my outfit sometimes mm -hmm.